Veterans Report brought to you by GEICO. Aaron, now five in a row, 10 out of your last 13 games. What do you think has been the biggest difference for this team over that span? You know, I think it's been a little bit of everything, Meredith. Um, you know, I, I feel like defensively we've really tightened up and are playing really well. Um, the starting pitching has been there for us and given us, whether it's whether it's a real dominating go deep in the game sometimes or keep us in the game, the bullpens continued to do its thing really all year long. And now the offense over the last couple of weeks, um, you know, even though we, I still feel like we haven't totally broke out yet, um, we're having really good at bats, really competitive at bats every night against, you know, and a good good pitching staff over there where, you know, last two nights we're able to, you know, get seven, get six tonight, get to them late. Um, you know, it's just it's just been a, a much better brand of baseball now, the way we're capable of. You can't really mention that offense without mentioning John Carlos Stanton. Another huge night for him. Just are you almost in awe of what he's been doing over the last two weeks? Yeah, it's been it's been great to see him. Just again, you know, he's he's a, he's a special special person and talent. And and you know, as I keep going back, I've been saying it for a couple of years. I just feel like he's been it's been this has been coming. And it's just about been about him getting on the field. We saw it obviously in the playoffs last year, and you know after that, you know week or two slow start, the at bats have just been so good night in and night out. With Montgomery, it seemed like a tough, tough couple tough breaks there, both in the third inning and in the fourth yeah. inning, but managed to grind through six. What gave you the confidence to keep him out there, not only the fifth but that sixth inning as well? Um, well, I liked him. I liked him going through, and and you know. Once he got Brantley out to get out of the fifth, um, you know, I felt like if we could squeeze another inning out of him, you know, I knew if he, if he got Bregman there to start the inning, you know, I like, you know, the lefty-lefty matchup with Alvarez. He ends up getting both of them, so he, then it was batter to batter, and, and he was able to get Correa out there, and then, you know, I felt like there was a nice lane there for Sessa to get us to the top, and, and obviously – Peralta comes in and gets a big out with the lefty, and then Lowe was terrific, obviously, in the eighth. So, um, you know, I, I thought Jordan threw the ball well. Um, I thought he was on the attack early, um, you know, scattered some hits around, but also made a lot of big pitches tonight. Go to Brendan Cuddy. Aaron, what's been the key for Giancarlo over the stretch? Well, I, I mean, he's a, he's a great player. He's a great hitter. He's and I just think he's <clears throat> I think he's just incredibly disciplined, you know, to his, you know, whether it's his routine, how to prepare himself physically, how to prepare himself mentally for the opponent, um, what his game plan is going in each day against a particular pitcher and and grinding to and sticking to that game plan. Um, and being disciplined to it. And, you know, I think coupled with, I think, physically being in a good spot where he's he's on time a lot and, you know, letting the body then go out and cash the checks, you know.